Well, Alabama is one of a few southeastern states that actually experiences a distinct secondary severe weather season. The secondary season typically affects our region during November and early December. Several deadly tornadoes have devastated Alabama communities during this secondary season. Guest in Etowah County Emergency Management Agency Operations and Planning Specialist Josh Tanner says powerful technology and early warnings can't save lives unless people are prepared, stay informed, and know how to react in the event of severe weather. Tanner says people need to have an emergency supply kit and have it ready. It's really important for them to be prepared with a kit that's easily mobile, that they know where it's going to be uh, in their home or in their car, and just to take some common sense uh, steps to be prepared. You know, have some bottles of water, have some, some food that doesn't have to be prepared uh, by cooking. Uh, those simple steps can make the difference, you know, between life and death sometimes if the catastrophic truly happens. Now, the EMA says Alabama is in an active weather region, so the question is not if we will have more devastating tornadoes, but actually, when will it happen again? We want to try to encourage folks to take the time to download some resources. There are a lot of good resources out there from the National Weather Service. Uh, we've got some on our website at the Gadsden Edward County EMA.com website to give uh, folks some ideas on things that they can do to help be prepared when the secondary season rolls around. Tanner says it's always a good idea to rotate the food stock and water supply in your emergency kit. And a good way to remember to do that is to do it at the same time you perform the preventative maintenance on your automobile. He adds that if you have children, make sure you take time to explain your in-house and off-property safety plan just in case the catastrophic events do happen.